ties to her hood. Harold Lorry, like many other English men, was a bad linguist. Up to now, this had not worried him. In most hotels on the continent, you always found everyone spoke English. So why worry? But in this out of the way place, where the native language was a form of Slovak, and in the servants spoke only German, it was difficult for Harold to understand them. So he was grateful to Mrs. Rice and Elsie when they acted as interpreters for him.
something. No, I'm, I'm all right. It's only the shock. This morning, a terrible thing has happened. Is Clayton seriously injured? Or is it that? He's dead. Dead? Yes, else he hit him right from the temple of the place. He's certainly dead. As if they've often loved him. But it was an accident. I can confirm Elsie's story. Yes, and you can confirm yours. That, that was just it. Yeah, take a seat. What can we do? My God, what can we do? Elsie, my little girl, I, I do anything. And you, your career, everything. I wonder now if something could be done. Yes? Well, how much money have we got? You're not much with me, but I could buy off the money, of course. You might need a good deal, but I think it will be worth trying. What is your idea? We haven't a chance of considering the debt ourselves, but I do think there's just a chance of pushing it up officially. You really think so? Yes, it's my opinion that in the state of European countries, you can write anyone and everyone.
Oh no, thank you. I am F. Q. Well, her. Shall we walk a little way to the wood and you shall tell me your story? As I say, I can kill you.